Welcome. Welcome into my den. The den is a place where I go for peace. Why else would the bear go to the bear's den? Why does the bear sort of just let it all out for three to three and a half months a year? I don't know the exact number of days that the bear, the bear spends in his hideout, but we must learn a little bit about the bear because what it's explaining to me is that sleep patterns, okay, in which I've really never learned, never took up in school, but seem to hear all these different terminologies for saying things. So I'm going to go on to the sleep pattern. Although this is not the video I started and I wanted to do and what I prepared for, although I didn't prepare very long, I only had five minutes, but that's okay. I'm not complaining. And I am want to show you and show everybody, hey, look at Mr. Tackpans, look what he does. Oh my God, he's always prepared. It's not about me. It is, but it's not. I try to keep it out. You know what I'm saying? I don't want it to be about me. I do, but I don't. I want it to be about this story, about what I have to say, about the way one can think and the visions he can get upon the visions he has upon his thinking. Did I say too many I think in buts? I didn't say but. It's usually yet and not but. I was told by a friend of mine, actually not a friend at all, a, an acquaintance, someone I do not know, but um, they told me I would be better off using yet instead of but. Because we want to butt it out. We don't want to stop the conversation, yet we will continue. Thus and therefore, I understood why they didn't want me to use the but. Because the butt is actually the back, back, back end. Your ass is your butt. There ain't nothing left to your body. You know what I'm saying? It's pretty rare in this world that somebody gets their butt cut off. You know what I'm saying? They only use it in an expression. A leg cut off, a finger cut off, chop their head off. Anything that's sort of protruding outside the body, we can cut it off. So you know what? For the Jewish boys in this world, that's what they did to you. They went downstairs to the point that extended further than any other point that still got hard at one years old, but we couldn't figure out why we got a hard on them or only three. That's the extension and the foreskin that they cut off for the Jewish people to come into this world. And the message within cutting off of the foreskin is more than just saying what it is. It's an opinion of Ben. Well, for me, an opinion of anybody, it's okay. But for me, it's like this. Opinion is someone's opinion of Ben. Ben in Hebrew means birth. Okay? Almost like we're going to get back to the bear. Now, how many months does he sleep? Because we all know that when we sleep, okay, how much does he sleep in the summertime, in the time the bear's up? And I know there's a bunch of different bears, but we have to take a basic somewhere down near number six. Everything I like to do is above four because four is down below five and it's less than average. Average is not good enough. Six is good. But we're not perfect. We can't be any more than six. So if we get a 60% average, blame it on the angel. He owns 40%. That's the 10% of the mind we use to get to the four angle. 10 and four, October 4th. 10, four. Four and six creates the 10. You cannot create it with one dice. It takes two and it takes a six and a four because it doesn't take a three because only a card has a seven and a three. And the three card has no four corners. And if there's no four corners, it's not in this world. It's not life. It's not here. It's not happening. There's three life and there's four life. The three life has the three line straight down. But in this world, the three life, okay, is more like this. This might be one of the reasons the bear sleeps for three months because of this. Something to do um, either with the earth being in a certain position, his mind empties out. For human beings, we sleep at night. We need to have a good day. We need to have a good rest. We need to have good things in our minds. So when we go to sleep, okay, the daily uh, tactics of the mind that it inquires within over a period of time, and sometimes that time is short, and you inquire it right away by getting in a fight with your boss. So you go to sleep at night. You empty out. Try to think of all the things you could have done wrong. Why think that you did anything right? What you're doing right is looking for what you did wrong. What's right is right. We don't need to discuss it. It's done. It's finished. It's over. doesn't matter. Oh, but I did this for him and him. And we don't want to know that. We want to know what's inside of you. What are you feeling? 
Are you feeling anything that's bringing you down for no reason? Are there things you don't understand? Because then when you go to sleep at night and you regenerate and wake up the next morning, aren't you supposed to feel fantastic? Because you've emptied out, and, but actually empty out or not, did you have the proper day you needed to have at work? Did everything satisfy you? We have to learn to make things satisfy us without actually giving up our liberties, okay? And still being able to go out and enjoy just about everything. We must, it's a must. Then you go to sleep at night, you wake up the next morning, you feel fantastic. I don't know about you, if it's Thursday morning, I feel fantastic. If it's Monday morning, I feel like shit. I gotta wait for my pace. So right away, there's something on my mind. Not good. You woke up on a Saturday. You feel great because you didn't really have a time to get up, but you set yourself a time because you say, I want to get up at that time. Because you need to do that. We need to schedule in life. That's what life's all about. You need a schedule for 24 hours. You got to remember a schedule of 24 hours. Plus, you got a schedule for the next 24 hours. But upon scheduling for the next 24 hours, these first 24 hours are now going away. So now what you actually got to do is even increase the amount of hours that you're preparing for the next day. And in how much time in advance can you actually prepare for tomorrow? Oh, you can prepare for tomorrow today. You can prepare for any tomorrow for any time right now by marking a date and that's tomorrow. Now, you always have to remember that upon months that have passed by for this so secure date that you've remembered now, it has become today. And today is the day before tomorrow of what you wrote down and what you had to do. And you notice in your day, you can't do tomorrow what you planned six months for. So what you do is you try to reschedule for the earliest recent time. And at the same time, you have to bump something that's not as important and it's okay if it bumps. Because usually there's things in our life we can bump. Just bump it. It's okay. Don't get mad and pissed off for your whole day. You're taking away that from your own life. You're not hurting me, you're hurting yourself. But if you're with me, it'll sort of be encouraging. I'm a savage beast. Ah, he's not feeling well. Hmm. What can I do to make him feel better? Obviously, sex is not involved in any of this. There is no sex, okay? When we talk about peace, okay, we are all unisexual, okay? Although, my piece is going to be different from a woman's piece. I mean, just look down below. She's got a slant, and I got some stick sticking out. Why does a woman have a slant and a guy have a stick? Well, take a look at this dot. If you go all the way through this dice, about five inches, that dot will stop, okay? Now what's on side on the outside of the dot that follows it would be the shaft of the piping of what you saw in the black hole. That's where the water will come out. You gotta imagine this is a pipe. It's no longer square. But wait a second. A lot of times when they do do pump piping, pumping piping, um, they do have octagons on it to put the two couplings together. The two couplings. Hello. How did we get those two couplings together? We used the unisex, the one spirit of God who connected one side to the other side. Look, very simple. This is the real God of creation. He's created this corner and this corner, okay? This is you in the center, okay? He's got you on both sides. Simple as that. So um, don't tell me I forgot the liberty, the freedom, the God. Where am I right now? We were on the dice. Oh, yes, and the woman, of course. She has this, right? Why don't you call it a slant, a slit, a slot, whatever you want to call it. It's a slot for the alpha man on this side and the alpha man on that side to get it right there. I mean, you can refer this to whatever you prefer. So we're going to get back to the bear sleeps, okay? Uh, no, we can't get back to the bear sleeps because I forgot. Tomorrow comes. We had a great day. Everything was great. But we're upset. We woke up. We don't feel good. Did we eat something wrong? Is it something my wife did? My child did? My dog did? Did I forget to clean up something that I know when I come home today I got to do it and I got other things on my mind? You know, it's just it's just like that. Um, just to let you know, I just looked at the clock at 9.47. <laughs> That's the one who speaks is the man, but the time said Jesus Christ.
I saw it right at the right time, and now I see 10 o'clock. Okay, let me get back to it. So tomorrow, when you wake up after everything went good, and you feel shitty in the morning, and you call up Mr. Tackman, you go, what went wrong? <laughs> System ain't perfect, is it? Well, no. One of the parts is, is that months before, or years before, okay, something that's still on your mind, that the system matrix must make, <coughs> must make you, <coughs> <coughs> I'm sorry, the system matrix must make you remember your angel four has now popped in his commentary words throughout the night of sleep. Somehow, um, it's like this, when you're up, the angel's asleep, when you're asleep, the angel is up, but it's not true. Do you know why? Because you're up for 16 hours a day and you're asleep for eight. So the question comes to be like this. What system do we run off the matrix? Well, they call this the mare, the mother system. They call it the me system of angel resident. Okay. I know I didn't finish with the getting up shitty, but I'm trying to explain to you. So this sleep, the angel resident sleep of the mare, which is actually the M letter for love, because M means mother. Mare, M-E-R, means the sea, means the ocean. Reverse it, it's R-E-M. R-E-M radio, R-E-M the sleep. Angel resident. Passage of the e-world of love. Where the two fours actually come together to join in the sleep between the two minds. The actual, I'd like to know how much more brain activity do we have when we sleep in a certain way than we have when we're awake. The two join together, the two minds join together. You get to see things, you've had dreams, and you get to see things that are so crazy in this world because your angel knows, and you are your angel, and the angel is you. You started it off together. I think it's a brand new angel every time you come into life. But the question is, is it the first life or the second life? Were there any other lives for any other people? Let us get back to Rem, because I would be jumping off onto something else, and I'd be just the regular Mr. Tack Pants. I don't really like to be that way, but here I go again. Here I go again. Let me light this up. So you get into a Rem sleep, okay? R, 18. R-E, which is also re of who? Re what? Read or re-add to put another read. To re-add the resident angel of E. Add in the E world. Okay, the M. The M letter, if you pull it apart, you have a V in the center and a stick here and a stick here, the same way McDonald's made their sign. Okay, McDonald's signs all say love on it. It says 23 love the McDonald's signs. Flip over the top part of the McDonald's sign. Okay? Flip it over. You'll see there's cuts alongside of it. Flip it over, and it's a W, beta creation. And underneath it is Roman numerals 1v1. Okay? So if you don't think that they did this purposely, I don't think so. I think somehow it comes from the underworld, the knowledge they have, because these computers have existed way before us. It's impossible anybody can connect everything I've connected together in the last seven years to come out here and talk about just about anything and be able to have an answer for just about everything. That way I will put myself up. But we're going to have to get back to REM. Okay, let me see if I can get to REM. What sleep would this be? Does it justify that I can talk about REM or anything after you see me light up a joint? Oh, look at that. He's smoking pot. No, I'm not smoking hash. Well, let's say this on the radio, on the TV. Is this against words? I didn't say a bad word, did I? George Carlin better come back because I think he's got to add this to the bad list of bad words. What was it? Shit, other guys? Whatever. Um, yeah, so is marijuana a bad word? Are you kidding? Did you hear on the radio what happened today? I'm still going to get back to Mayor, okay? They just said, now, I'm not sure if this was a hoax, okay? I'm not sure if it was a hoax. But they said Barack Obama went to somewhere in Mexico and 12 of his, um, 
12 of his uh, bodyguards were caught, okay, with prostitutes. Barack Obama, he pays $50,000 a week, I think, to, or 100000 a week or whatever it is. He pays these guys, they were caught with prostitutes. So this may not be true. But you know what's true about it? Is I heard it. And now you hear it. And now you know. Protests? Did we get about to protest? Don't worry, I didn't forget about REM. You know what I believe about protests? And I said this in a previous video, and I told you the truth, that I only believe it because somebody else said it first. I'm just repeating it because I believe what the secondary one said of the first secondary of the view of the vision of what they saw. So, what we're going to actually get to is like this. They are paying people, students, money to go in, okay, into these protests and start fights. Just so eventually the police will be able to come in and start their new world order, new vamping up of the police officers. Okay, and it's starting here in my town. Okay, now the first thing I want to tell you before I get back to REM sleep. Okay, REM sleep. It's starting here in my town and it's a little scary because I saw this happening about November or October last year. I, like I said in a previous video, I moved out of my house. Bad thing happened here. It was weird. It was weird. I'm going to get back to REM sleep. I'm going to get back to REM sleep. Hold on. So anyways, yeah, bad things happened up here and they're paying these people to go to protests and start fights and other things. I think the protesters have to go out there and um, try to figure out, do something a little bit smarter than what they're doing just to protest. Back off, give them a lot more space. Don't stay so close. It's not how close you are, it's how many you are. Do you understand protesters out there? It's not how close you are and you don't have to shake your flags. You don't have to do this. You can calm on the bullhorn, my friends. Haven't you heard of a little secrecy amongst the gang, not letting anybody know what's inside the actual thought? Got to move back, my friends. We got to move back. We must move back. We have to move back. We move back because it rhymes with back and attack. It also sounds with Big Mac attack. So, you know, the word had to become very popular with time, didn't you know? Like I told you, flip that McDonald's signs over where the three sl slits are, and you will see the upside down W146. Oh, my God. 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 I'll get back to REM sleep. Oh, my God. That's insane. When you flip the W over... It becomes, it's, I mean, the M over, part of it, half of it, becomes the W, meaning the queen. 23 and 23 is 46. It's angel and man. Three of them is 69. It's the cancer sign. Four of them is 92, is this, and this was the leap year. Wow. Five of them is 115, and that's the power outage of our computers. Add 23 more, and it's uh, 138, and that's creation of the heavens. Add 23 more. 148, 158, 161, the one spirit of man, then it goes to 84. That's the um, that's the um, three dice. It's the three dice. Oh my god, it connects all the sides. Oh my god. That's 184. It doesn't mean it's happening. I'm just telling you that's the number. So 184, I get 23 more. It's 207. So now we've made the round of beta god. Why? Because 207 is the last number before you hit 230. And that's a repeat 10 times. Nine times is 207. 207, the beta god, 2 and 7, 7 and 2, 9 times 8. Anyways, let me explain to you how it works. McDonald's sign upside down. I'm going to get a black marker. I'm not going to mark this on anything nice. First, I'm going to show you what it, what it looks like the regular way. This is what McDonald's looks like the regular way. Okay. And when you turn it upside down, this is what it says. Kiss my ass, it says. Don't you see it looks like an ass? Okay. This is beta creation. The reason for these two bubbles over here, because the two eggs, okay, 
Both the two eggs, the angel and man, or the spirit of man, are coupled in this eggs. Well, why would you say coupled in these eggs? I've told you, McDonald's eggs. Don't you understand? The the egg goes here. What do you think a woman? The woman has two eggs in her. Don't you understand? God didn't put two eggs for nothing. They were here for a reason. They had to be used. And part of the usage, in fact, and all of the usage, in fact, part of the usage was for birth. But all of the usage was our connection. Our connection to connect this puzzle, oh, don't forget, I won't talk, I'll talk to you about REM, is to connect this puzzle together. Piece by piece, corner by corner. So the two eggs, okay? I mean, if you put God in here, it would say good. Okay, if you take out one O, does anybody know why we don't put the O in God? You know why we don't put the O in God? Because the middle of everything, okay, on the three worlds, this G should be up here to G. I think it's be G, uh, D, and then O would be over here. That would be in one scenario if I was doing tic-tac-toe. But anyways, to explain to you this, what 4-0 means, okay, uh, is I'm going to try and show you on this dice. 4-0, okay, is, actually, that's not it. Here it is. Not the, the wrong side. I'm really screwed up. Ah, 4-0. Okay, the combination of 4-0. 2, 3, 4, 5. Four numbers that are not there. The outline is one and six. When you play in between, it's only the in between that counts. So that would count for your zero four, right? Now, if you want to count for the number seven, okay, it becomes um, a three, okay? Let me show you this. I think I screwed up. Uh, so if it was going to be a, it would be like this. That would be the seven. The four that was in between before goes on top of here, okay? And the reason it goes on top of here, I'm going to show you, okay, here. Now, when you turn it around, there you go. Hold on a second. 77. Did you understand that? <laughs> it's, I couldn't remember it. It's... You, you know when you count from 2 to 6, or from or from 1 to 8, or from 3 to 5, there's only one in between. The one that's in between is the number 4. So now you got 1, and you got 4, just like you had 7 and 4. So now I'm going to explain to you, God, what happens. So this is Christ, because this is what, he's the passage gate, and he's the four corners. Okay, this is the ball's eye corner. If you add this in here, which is the man's egg, it's only one of the man's eggs. And then it's it's number 7154. And what happens here, okay, is this is the egg 15th letter or number 6. But God is not the spirit of man. God is the gates of the angels. So that's why you can't put the O in there. He is the God in totality, right? It's But it's an it's more, you can only put it in an expression, put the O in some way. Uh, but you can't put the O. The reality is there has to be two O's because God put two into this world. The angel and the man, or the angle of the man, when he dies, he gets back an angel. But he's put himself into this world. And now we can get into a real big puzzle, but we're going to have to go back to the REM sleep, I think. Okay, so what happens now is you got up the next morning, Pretty good, I remember, eh? When I smoke weed I, or hash, I remember so much better. And if you want to know that what I'm talking about, I'm going back to Reme. Eh? I know I'm very fast. I speak very, very quickly. The reason I speak quickly is because I'm bipolar. Wait a second, who said that? Who said that? L let me repeat myself, okay? People, okay, will... Um, give you their reason why I am fast. And that is what I just did. I gave you the reason of a non-viewer. Because if I was slow, I would say I was slow. So I'm right now I'm going with, um, first of all, I've been told I'm fast. And somebody told me, Frubum, blah, 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 blah. I made a big mistake somewhere. So listen, this is a story I am writing. It's what's inside 
my mind. Okay, it's what's inside my mind. What's inside my mind right now? I'm putting REM on the side. I can sit here for another hour, but I'm not. Because otherwise, I'd probably have to stay stoned for the whole hour. Because when I am stoned, it is so freaky. It is so good. I vision. What you can see, I can see. If you can see, I can see. And you see, the whole thing about that is, what you can see well, I won't see well. But I'll be able to see what I see. I usually, I look at my pictures, my own pictures I'm doing, I go, oh, I did that. No, I did this. So I'd move back to chair about four feet, and I go, oh, baby, that's different. Yeah, a lot of color. I like that color. I have to show you this picture. I always love these pictures. This is my favorite picture, those two there. How come it's not coming in the camera? There it is. See that? You take a look on the left, there's a pharaoh bird. And between his legs, and everybody knows you don't want to put between the legs, it says a nutchi. Okay? You see all the birds of pharaoh? And on the other side, you see a seven in the, in the middle. You see an NB on the right. This is what's going to happen in the next two years from now. Okay? See the egg inside, the blue egg on the right? You see the double sun in the background on the bottom, black sun? And then all the roosters, and you see the three blue planets at the top? Okay? They weren't planets. They were thumbtacks. And when I looked at them from a distance, I said, oh, my God. I said, they're planets. Wow. So, anyways, yeah, you got the bird there. And then you got at night, okay, you see the evil birds on the right and the ones all hanging on the same thing? At night, oh, wait, wait a second, at night it turns into like Donald Duck. And one of the pictures in the corner um, uh, turns into the, like an animal eating something. It's really cool. Anybody want to buy my stuff? <laughs> Does that sound real or not? So, um, no, I don't have any. For, I'm, I don't sell. My neighbor used to come by. You think you can give me a five, a ten? The first week, I did. You know, I overcharged a few bucks because I have to go pick it up. You know, I'm a cheapie. And uh, yeah, I said, oh, my God, if this guy tells somebody and I sell to another one, I don't want any of this. I'm going to have enough trouble being Mr. Tack Pans on YouTube, showing up in Facebook, showing up hopefully one day in Tumblr, oh, back over in MySpace and Orit, or down over in Google where they have me 34,000 whatever. I've done something that says 34,000. I don't know if it's supposed to be good because 34,000 in golf is no good. So sometimes the higher numbers are no good. So, um, oh my God. So anyways, I just want to tell, tell everybody something. Today is an anniversary for me because it is 30 years ago today, okay, that I officially put my foot April 17th. Yes, there were still two more months of exams in uh, April, May, June, or whatever it was. Yeah, they threw me out. Threw me out! And I went to the principal and I said, you know what I said to the principal? I said, let me tell you something. I said, I didn't know anything about law back then. Okay? I knew nothing about law. It's just thinking. Just thinking. Because, you know, we bumped into each other three, four times. I put my hand through a window once. Not because I tried to, but the door was swung open to me. I put my hand out to stop it. And the principal says, I get three days off. I know my dad will take me at work, so I go to work for three days. Never was thinking of taking a day off and smoking weed. Are you kidding? Do that at work. Um, so, yeah, so what happens? You throw, I, and I say, listen, I said, I'm coming back to do my exams. He says, no, you're not. He says, once you miss three months of school, I says, to do an exam, it matters how many days you've been here. Isn't it not the knowledge of the man? I says this. I says, where are the papers that say I am expelled and cannot do it? I said, you have the papers. And uh, I said, if you don't have the papers, I'm going to be back. I says, I'll be back when the exams start. But your name's not going to be on the list. I says, don't you worry. My name will be on the list, and your name won't be on the door. <laughs> I got thrown out of school for having a Big Mac attack. Principal says you're not allowed out. I says, says who? I says, I got a big mag attack to this pickles under that sesame seed on a sesame seed bun. Anyways, back to McDonald's, okay, before REM sleep. Okay. I just want to go back to McDonald's for a second, if you don't mind. 
Back to McDonald's. Where's McDonald's? So here's the W now. Let's flip it this way. It looks like this. Roman numerals. 1, 5, 1. Total, 7. 23 and 7 is 30. Creation to start. 4 minus 1 Roman numeral. F. V. E. V plus 1 Roman numeral. Excuse me. Did I do it the right way? Huh. It's, it's backwards, okay? It's supposed to say death. Just like on your telephone. Now, you ever check that on your telephone? What numbers are they? Death. A, B, C, D, E, F. Death. Of course, A, B, C, D, E, F. A, B, C, D, E, F. Man! A, B, C, and D, E, F. And G, H, I. G, and I, because it's God in the birth, the ninth letter birth. The H is the heaven. J, K, L. Well, that's us. The combination of man, angel, and spirit is a jack. The queen is this beta world that gives us life. Okay? And the king is the spirit, the one spirit of creation, God. And it's a king. And then you got L, M, N. Now, the L is a repetition of the Q. Okay? Bec but, um, excuse me, the L is a repetition, a rep... Oh, my God. The L, M, N. The L is the twelfth letter. In the deck of cards, the, okay, the twelfth card is a queen, okay? M is also a replacement for the king, because the M is the thirteenth letter, and the king is the thirteenth card, like MK. Uh, N, well, there is no fourteenth card, but wait a second. N is the fourteenth letter. One spirit, the angle of four. And what does that give you? It gives you the second ace. Because, listen, the first ace is here. The second ace is here. Okay? The third ace is here. That's it. That's the way it works. After that, the numbers are on each side. Okay? So now we already got uh, K L M no, L M N. I mean, does anybody know what I'm doing right now? I'm doing where the letters are on those old telephones, A, B, C, D, E, F. So put it back and listen. You don't have to believe if it's actually the truth of what the reality of who created it that way and why, which in all actuality, it's probably dot, diddle, dot, 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 line, something like that. You know what I'm saying? It, I mean, to do 26 letters, right, in, in, in Morse code or in my own language, okay, it's level one, two, three, one, two, three. Three per each one. Nine. There you go. And each one is nine. It's 81. Got it all. Now we're going to get back, and we're going to see where those letters are. I'm going to try to keep track of them, where we got to. I finished at N. The other one is OPQ. OPQ. Where did I get to? But N, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N. N is the 19th. L is it L M N that's together? Holy Christ! How am I gonna know? Oh, I'm gonna have to do my best. And uh, let me let me start from the end. A B C. You don't mind waiting for me? Give me like thirty seconds. D E F G H I J K L M N. Oh my God! I made a mistake. The J K L are together, but I already mentioned it before. I repeated myself, but I had put the L with the M and N, and it's not with the M and N. So what I'm going to do is, because this would be um, a big process, I'm going to get back to REM sleep, maybe, or stop it here, okay? I have to do REM, okay, and awake, and sleep, because I can do anything, man. I smoked a good joint, and you know what? I'm flying, but I'm starting to go down, and I don't want to rush it. So maybe I should finish off by just telling you it's 30 years today that I put my foot into the job market and I busted my nuts for many, many years and I pissed away my money forever and and I have no more cigarettes. And you know what? As much as I pissed away my money, I worked twice as hard. So I guess I might have paid the ransom somehow. You know, I knew the job had to get done. I don't really ever thought I had a money problem anytime I worked even at 250 an hour. It's not that long ago, 30 years. What's 30 years? 
I am now part of the creation inside the creation worlds. Therefore, 30 years ago, and I could be wrong, it's 2012, it's 31 years. Wow, I knew something was wrong. Wow. This year is 31, next year is 32, the year after is 33. Oh my God. Oh my God, another number clicks. <laughs> 33 and 19 is 52. Oh my God. You know what that equals to? Oh my God, that's insane. But I have to say it. It's a book. My mind's in the book. I must become and be consumed by the book. I become the year of Christ in the business world. Christ came here from birth. Everybody knew who he was. He played around till 33 in the business world of Christ. And thus they took him away. So me in 2014 is my 33rd year. So uh, let's see, how uh, old would I be? 33 and 17 is 50. Now, either it's 50 or 51. I think it has to be 51. October of that year would be 51. So I would be the five angle spirit of man, which would make me the only beta spirit that can live on this earth. I have the power of the angels inside of it and it's given to very few and you never know until the last minute so the numbers bringing up that number of years in the workplace okay is to tell you that if you've worked anywhere for 33 years and more take a reflection upon your life lie back have a beer go outside it's beautiful light up a joint and just look back for a laugh because it's all a laugh. It's all in the past. It's all a laugh. It's all over. It has happened. It is a movie. It's in a book. In fact, we have sort of, um, it is our guidelines that brought us to where we are right now. Okay, I'm leaving out the ram and we're going to get back to the telephone. I really appreciate it. This is Raphael7286, but before I go, I will say my N-words, and my N-words are this. A man with two names, Ron Paul is the only honest man I ever wanted to see in my whole life. Now, if I had a choice, and I'm going to tell you right now, I don't want to be murdered, please. But if somebody says to me, would you give your life so that Ron Paul can be president? I would have to say, yeah. The only thing I don't want is take me in my sleep. Because if I know that God is asking, and I can save the whole planet, well, who else wouldn't refuse? I wouldn't refuse, never. I'd be the first one out there. But I don't want to know. <laughs> I just want it to be a thought in my head. No one's supposed to really hear this. It's in the book. It didn't come from me. Hold on a second. We're going to change this. Hold on a second. Okay, it was on the paper. The guy just passed me. I wasn't sure what I was reading. Sometimes I go so fast I don't really listen, so I make mistakes. So if I made any mistakes, I'm sorry for you and you and you and you and you. This is Raphael7286. We stand for Mr. Tacpans, who shows only two numbers tonight. 72. What's going on? What day is it today? Ah, we are into the 17th day. The 89th day today. The four angle month. Oh, what a day. This is such a strong day. The 92nd day this year was April 1st. So that would be 16 days later is 98. Is that right? Is this the 98th day? This is the 90. Oh my God, I don't even know. What month are we in? April 1st was 92. April 10th was 100. So this would be 107 or 108. Doesn't matter. 107 is just fine. 107 or 17 as the date says, and it's 744. Okay, if you're confused about what I'm doing right now, I'm trying to read through things as I'm talking to you. So anyways, you get you get you got a um, a piece of uh, me uh, in action. Raphael 7286. Hey, it didn't stop. Well, no, no, no. Okay, I'm stopping it at 39, 39. 